What's up everyone? This is Scott with Team 512 and I'm back with another video. And I'm heading back to AWE. Alright, so I'm on the way to visit our friends at AWE. Ooh, nice little crispy downshift. So I opted to do the exhaust on my C7 here in stages. First thing I purchased was the AWE Performance X pipe. I've had it on the car for about two weeks now. And I gotta tell you, man, if you wanna retain the NPP capabilities of your exhaust and be able to go in and out of stealth mode, track mode, you don't wanna sacrifice that functionality, get an X pipe and pull the fuse. Once you pull the fuse, it keeps the baffles open all the time. And that in combination with uh, their Performance X pipe has just been so much fun to drive this car. It's not overbearing, there's no drone, just gives it that extra little bit of growl. I found that downshifts kind of burble and pop a little bit more. And when you get up into the higher RPM range, the exhaust really screams, it sounds great. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are pulling into AWE's World HQ. And, uh, you know, they always have a pretty cool lineup of cars here. So let's just join in. Nice wide parking spots, too. I definitely appreciate that. All right, so I'm in AWE's World HQ, and uh, I'm walking around here, and I found something interesting. Come on, let's go. I'm in their conference room. You can see one of their original signs on the wall back over here. And they've got this really cool door. And I'm guessing that might be from one of their original facilities. But check this out. See this little door? We open it up. We can see the complete history of AWE right here. That's awesome. All right, so let's go find Jesse so I can go find my exhaust. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's okay, I just lost him. How are you? I'm good, good to see, good you. To see you. Let's go. Hey, there he is. Ah, what's up, man? How what's are up? you? I'm great, how are you? I bet you're here for your axle back. I am. I think we should go get it. Let's do it. Let's go. Awesome. All right, that end was a little awkward, but that made up for it, because that wasn't awkward. Yeah, man. So I think you're totally going to dig this. The reviews have been really good. The 180 technology has been great. No drone. It's all made out of stainless. So it's going to be really easy to put on as well. Yeah, that's yeah. great. Yeah, well, mates up to all the factory touch points. All right, so I know I'm here picking up an axle back for a C7 Corvette, but this thing caught my eye. What are we looking at? Jesse? Yeah, this is the new RS3. Um, we've had a lot of success in the exhaust line here. So we're actually doing a full, totally crazy uh, carbon fiber intake. It's gonna create awesome gains, but yeah, if you wanna take a look at it. It's not a Corvette. It's gonna be totally nuts. But hey, let's go talk Corvette. I think one of the things you're gonna dig about it, more from a butt dyno perspective, but you're gonna feel actually 22 awesome, max dude. horsepower. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Which is that's crazy, great. that's the axle back and the, and the uh, X-Pipe. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, it should be really cool. I think I might is that see it? a box that's Is that cool. it? Yeah, it could be it. This is like Christmas again. It's like Christmas. Every time I come yeah. here, it's like Christmas. Yeah, that's what we try and do. AWE is Christmas. It's Christmas time in the Team 512 garage. So the awesome folks at AWE are allowing me to use their beautiful conference room here to uh, unbox this touring axle back for you guys. So uh, yeah, let's get started doing that. 
it really is like Christmas morning. So if you saw my X-Pipe video, you'll know how well they package their products. And uh, I bet this is no different. <laughs> this is what I came here for. Look at that. That is awesome. Let's see what else is in here. Yeah, incredibly well packed, you guys. One of the over the axle pipes. Let's slide this down so you guys can actually see some of this. I'm gonna carefully put this on their conference room table here. I'm sure it's not the first time they've had some exhaust components on this table. That's a full three inch over the axle pipe. And remember, all of this is made right here in the USA, including the steel. This is the second over the axle pipe. We also have a bag of hardware here and some installation instructions. And another one of these mufflers. And what you guys have all been waiting for in this box is the diamond black tips. Let's take a look at these. Oh my gosh. You guys have to see this. Ready? All right, it's time to head home and get this axle back installed. I got it all in the car. You saw the unboxing. Now it's all packaged nicely in the back of the Corvette. And uh, we're gonna head home and uh, get this thing up on the lift in the Team 512 garage and get this axle back on. All right, everybody, I just got home from AWE and uh, I know I snaked you a little bit with these tips, so let's get them into the garage, open them up, and take a look at them. Are you guys ready to see the AWE Diamond Black tips for the C7? Let's do it. Look at these tips, you guys. How awesome are they gonna look on the Grand Sport? And even cooler, watermelon this time. So there you go guys. There's the uh, diamond black tips for the uh, C7 touring axle back that's about to go onto the car. But in order to see that video, you gotta hit that subscribe button because uh, this video is over. I know, I know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But uh, I promise the next one will be real soon, okay? So hit that subscribe button, give me a like, and uh, leave me some comments. You guys know I love interacting with people who love Corvettes and cars just as much as I do. Till next time, see ya.